Patanjali Chavan Prash Pro Wrestling League Season 3 Devya Sajjana Ab Wakt Hai Purusho Ke 65 Yani Ke 65 Kilogram Of Varg Khushti Ka Mumbai Maharati Ki Or Se A Ra Hai Russia Mool Ke Shoslan Romato Patanjali Chavan Prash Pro Wrestling League Season 10 Purushoke is Pesat Kilogram Varkushni NCR Punjab Royals Kior Siara Russia Mulke Ilias Back Bulato So our final belt this evening, men's 65 kilograms, already a resounding victory for Punjab Royals. And the man who's going to try and change that, Suslan Ramanov, the Olympic champion, a Russian up against a fellow Russian. Ilyas Bekvilarov, who's the European champion. So a great uh, contest, uh, contest in prospect. And this one that uh, Vek Belatov would be hoping that he can cause an upset in. Ajit Man, our referee for this one. Could have been a great finale if things had been level, but uh, that incredible performance from the Punjab Royals this evening. They are leading 5-1. to one. Can they make it 6-1? Which will, of course, have a big bearing... Um, on whether they finish top or second in the uh, league table stage of the competition. He served in the military, Soslan Ramanov. So that discipline has definitely yielded results, including an Olympic gold for uh, Soslan Ramanov. Ramanov. As you can see in the white top. These two must know each other really well. And uh, it'll be an interesting one because in these situations, they know the favourite attacking moves. They know how well the other can defend. And remember, we talked about uh, grapplers being unbeaten during the league stage. Soslan Ramanov is another one who's fought four bouts before this and won each of those bouts. Now looking for a takedown here. Good defense by uh, Pek Bulatov, but uh, can he manage a push out? Yes, it will be a push out for a solitary point for Soslan. As I was saying, he's the unbeaten grappler. Beat Haji, beat uh, Bajrang Punya, beat Amit and Harpool in the previous four bouts. And now up against his uh, fellow countryman, Pek Bulatov. So Soslan up 1-0, thanks to that uh, push out. A minute and a half gone in the opening round. Both men just sizing each other up. You'll have to give them that, albeit Soslan looking the stronger of the two. He does. That's what I was just thinking the same thing, Raman. Well, of course, uh, weight-wise, they're very similar, but he does look the, the stronger man, Soslan Ramanov. And uh, Bek Belatov. Going for the, the leg hold there, couldn't get in underneath because uh, Ramanov showing he's got good speed in defence as well. We talked about Soslan's military training, remember he had uh, gold in the World Military Championships as well in 2017. But now, Bek Bulatov was the aggressor but he's in trouble. Two points for a takedown signalled and confirmed by the jury. So Soslan now up 4-0. But 
Conduct, conduct. Peg Bulatov's just a little conduct. perturbed. He's looking conduct. at his bench and saying, hang on, aren't you going to protest that two-pointer that's been given? And I think he's asking for a protest, yes, which will be lodged now. Well, not many protests have actually, not many challenges have gone the, the way of the wrestler, but I think he felt that um, nothing was completed, that the grip was broken, and uh, I can see why he's asking for it, but I don't think it's a very yeah. clever move. Let's take a look at the replay. The video referral has been asked for. Soslan got behind Beck Bulatov. This was the takedown on the side, yielding two points. Beck Bulatov quickly recovered. Now, the important part is, were three joints making contact with the mat when this takedown happened? Look at it now. On the side now. Is that going to be good enough for two points? I dare say yes. I would think so. As I say, it challenges have been notably unsuccessful and I think that's a bit rash to go for it the only thing way I can see this going is an extra point for a failed challenge there we are and it goes five up because uh, he was never gonna now come back here for Beck Bulato a takedown for two now can he flip Soslan over and add to the tally not much time left on the clock. Soslan wriggles out of that hold. Stays it to the end of the first period. Three minutes has looked uh, too wily, too experienced and too strong for his opponent so far. 5-2 he leads. It's uh, too little too late, but at least... Uh, the Olympic champion will want to come out of this with a victory to save face a little bit for Mumbai Maharati. Big attack from uh, Vek Balakov, takes his man down, gets the two points. He's now in range. Can he turn his man over and turn it into a four-pointer? No, he can't. But that really, the, the first signs that uh, he might be able to do something yet. He yeah, reacts with great speed, whatever Soslan Ramanov tried to do to get out of it. Vek Balakov managed to uh, counter and eventually got his takedown and got his two points and once again Bek Bolarov now what's been given there is one point and that takes it to 5-5 the push out is given so now we're all level turns his man and just spins him round and uh, they're in contact so it's now five all. And again, Bek Malarov. And that one, though, goes the way of Ramanov. Ramanov getting the one pointer this time. That's the push out. So 6 5 now. Soslan Ramanov for the Mumbai Maharati in the lead. Soslan pushes out, that brings it back to six all, unbelievably. Oh, oh, oh. Six all, uh, Ilyas Bekbalarov just uh, needing a little bit of attention. All action, second period here. And uh, Ramanov, having found himself behind, has to react and does so very very quickly gets the push out just uh, six all still over a minute to go and some attention for Beck Bilatov it looks as if it's the magic spray okay 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 doctor 
the medics in there and the referee uh, anxious to get on with it. I think they're worried that there's some actual damage to the knee. See, maybe a bit of a twist there as that push out took place. Is he fit enough to continue? Well, he'd already got a bandage on that knee, a stocking, a sleeve to protect it. So he's obviously had problem with that knee before. Now, is he fit enough to continue? Okay, normal. Tell the coach. So remember, six six. John and uh, Soslan Ramanov gets another push out. Takes the lead again, goes to 7-6. Advantage no, Mumbai no. Maharati, it's only all only too only. little too late, and Elias Bekvilarov certainly oh, no. worried about that knee. No, no. Hey, well, there's still 55 seconds, so theoretically, He's got a chance to turn this one round even now. Uh, Bek Vladov looking a little bit more mobile again now. Soslan Romanov just with the, the narrowest of leads. The man with the red belt. And Bekvalada won't want to get into a situation where he's in a straight push because that knee is obviously a shade weak. That looks as if he's getting it back. Less than 10 seconds to go now in this bout. I think uh, Sosland's got all the experience. He can hold on from here. Last desperate attempt from Bekvalada, but the six minute shows on the clock. A brilliant battle between the two of them. And the final score. Yes, please. Soslan Romanov. Well, Elias Bekvilarov is um, going straight over to the medic. He has got to come back onto the mat and accept the verdict from the judge first. Well, I don't think uh, the judges and the referee will be very impressed with that, but uh, Soslan Romanov. His arms raise the loft. Now Bek Bilardo comes to the middle. They redo it. A terrific bout. 